Another night, another murder, another day to question why. One man was shot and killed. Another was shot and is in critical condition tonight. That shooting happened in the alley just east of the 3000 block of Winthrop near 30th Street and Fall Creek. Our Derek Thomas is live there with the story tonight. Derek. Erica, the shooting involved illegal gambling. The victims were playing dice. Police are trying to piece together what happened. Dead is 42-year-old William Watson. 41-year-old Robert Johnson is in critical condition at Eskenazi Hospital. The shooting occurred at just after 10.30. Police discovered the men lying in the alley. They also discovered a large amount of money. Detectives want to talk to Johnson to get a better handle on what happened, but he is heavily sedated and has not been questioned. Folks in the neighborhood have been asking questions, but so far there are no answers, only more bodies. They don't care about life. Life is to them is cut short because they don't want to get out there and work for what they want to have. They want to snatch it from someone else. That's not right. Jesse White has been operating this barber shop right across the street from the shooting area for 41 years. He knows a new police recruit class is coming in, but will that matter? They can't be everywhere at one time. You can't be here and there and there and here, you know, it's happening all over the city. Police agree that the solutions will have to be a community effort. It's uh, mind-boggling at this point, you know, we believe the police department, we're doing everything that we can. Uh, we're trying to develop innovative projects and we hope to uh, make some further announcements about our summer plans and what things we're going to be uh, trying to target. So far this year, there have been 67 murders. At the same time last year, there have been 53. Live from 30th and Winthrop, Derek Thomas, RTV6.